What's up everybody, Mr. OG Games here. And today we're gonna do some speed training to get our front line up to par with the T-13s. And my apologies for being so quiet over the last few weeks. Uh, in a nutshell, life has been crazy busy. I've got some new adventures planning not for YouTube, but in my personal life, and uh, things have just been very busy. So it's time to try to get back and get into some gaming when the time is available, and that's just what we're doing here. This did take place a few days back. I decided to go ahead and use a few of the scrolls that I had saved up, taking the recruitment speed up a level or so, and uh, cause it was time to get a good amount of T-13 calves trained. And uh, after putting the equipment on, putting the recruitment speed skill with the beast, switching around some artifacts, it was time to get going. And it did knock down from right at three days to about one day in 20 hours so it helped out dramatically uh, I'm not gonna put you through the whole entire thing of me training a hundred thousand plus troops so I'm gonna let that speed along but while you're watching that I did want to take some time and let you guys know that I have been reading your comments and we have a lot of new things to talk about uh, they've done a lot of revamping with the game they of course overhauled mystic and uh i'll be talking about that hopefully within a day or so uh i know i've gotten a lot of comments where from people that do have uh, a 31 and up castle uh some people that aren't quite to even 30 yet but want to know kind of what's going on with mystic what's changed with it because they cannot see it so we'll go through and discuss where mystic is what direction that i think that they took with the mystic because honestly opening up the new stuff and even opening up new mystic building levels to achieve these things as a right it's 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 a lot and uh is is it worth it i mean I don't know. I'll save that for that video because I don't want to go on a rant. But after going through and training some of these T-13s, if you were able to see it in that fast-paced uh, show on the video there, they are expensive. And yes, it does take a little more stone, a little more iron, but the amount of wood and food required to train T-13s is absolutely insane. Um, I ripped through several packs uh, because I need to get, I need to, with no farms here, I need to get, I need to get plunder and I need to get done pretty quick uh, just to keep pace with training troops. Um, I think the wood was just under a million a pop and the same thing with food I mean it goes by really fast now if you were to train them set it and forget it yeah I mean after three days you would have enough obviously to go ahead and train another but when you're speed training them it will chew through those resources uh, so that's why the biggest thing in this game is time and well besides as right and a few other things but time time in this game is essential so that's where you want to have your recruitment speed as high as possible to knock down so when you're using these speed ups you're not speeding up the full amount I was able to not quite cut it in half uh, but even so at a, a day and 20 hours that's a long time you're talking 44 hours of speed ups you do the math it's a lot so with that said, I was able to go ahead and take up one troop type, and I did that on purpose because I wanted my front row 
T13 calves, and I've got that now. Not for an expanded march, but just for my regular march. And uh, we've got T13 archers baking in the oven, and uh, hopefully we can get those out and get those done pretty soon as well. But as always, if you guys like the video, smash the thumbs up button, and if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, and you know the rest. Peace out.